Good morning children, class 3. Today in this video, I will explain you lesson number 1, a computer system. This is the part 1 and I will make another video for the remaining portion of this chapter. Okay, so now let's start with it. What is a computer system? A computer is a smart electronic machine. It helps us to perform a variety of tasks such as doing calculations, storing data, listening to music and much more. Children, you must have seen this. What is this? It, this is a computer. A computer is also known as a system as it is made up of various parts that work together to complete any work. These parts are divided into two categories that is hardware and software. Now what is hardware? See the image? Yes, printer, hard disk, CPU, RAM, mouse, keyboard, monitor, all these are hardware. Why? Because the physical parts of a computer system that can be touched or felt are called hardware. For example, keyboard, mouse, CPU, monitor, printer, etc. Hardware cannot work on its own. Many hardware components work only if their software is installed on the computer. Okay? Now, what is software? Software is a set of instructions given to a computer to do a particular task. It cannot be touched or felt. Yes? Software supports the working of hardware. Okay? Then, software are of two types. System software and application software. Now, here you can see in this image what is written types of software. So, there are so many types of softwares. Okay. Next is types of software. So, we have just discussed there are two types that is system software and application software. So, now let's see. System software are essential for the, essential means required needy we need it okay it is very important for the working of a computer but application software it these softwares are used to perform specific these are used to perform some specific task okay some particular task the examples of system software are operating system for example windows mac etc then utility softwares for example antivirus then examples of application software are Microsoft Word, Paint, PowerPoint and much more. Okay. Next is how does a computer work? A computer works on the machine mechanism of IPO cycle. What is IPO? IPO means input, process, output. It involves three steps. So what are these three steps? Input, process, output. Okay, now see the image. In this image, this is the IPO cycle of making orange juice. So, the input is number of oranges. Then the process is a juicer with the help of which we are processing the juice. And the output is the processed juice. Okay, this is the final result of the mechanism. Next and last is Input, process and output that is IPO. What is input? Input means the data and instructions that are entered into the computer. Okay. Then what is process or processing? Processing is done when computer reads data and performs given instructions on the data. Okay. Then what is output? Output is the result obtained after the processing understood now let's understand this with the help of example for example 
input is 10 plus 5. So there are two numbers 10 and 5 and we have this symbol plus symbol or we can say addition operation is being performed. So the process is addition okay and the final output is 15 because when we add 10 and 5 we will get 15 as the result. Okay children I hope you have understood all these things very well. Thank you class.